Hey everybody, just before we hit Lake San Vicente, me and Philip were unprepared. We were happy to find that East County Bait and Tackle was open at 4.30 a.m. Tackle shops today are running thin on stuff due to COVID-19. That is not the case here with Jack. Jack, what do you got in? We got a little bit of everything, man. You know, right now it can be pretty difficult finding reels, rods, really any plastic bait. Everything's running pretty thin, but uh, we've managed to keep a good selection of everything. As you can see, especially the swim baits, everything from uh, you know your basic stuff, river seas, nice and simple, to some of your more exclusive JDM baits, and then even a lot of local baits by some guys. Uh, everything from mat lures, we got PD rats, morning woods, triple trouts, depths. We also have some more custom, unique ones in the case over there. So definitely no shortage on selection. Yeah, and the lure fishing isn't your thing. They got live bait here. What kind of live bait do you guys carry? Oh, we carry shiners for the most part. Small, medium, large, sometimes extra large. And then seasonally we'll have crawdads. And of course we got night crawlers, box worms, meal worms, all that good stuff. Cool, we're super thankful to be here. They saved their ass this morning. Literally everything on my list of stuff to buy was here. Everybody was so helpful. Thank you guys so much. We really appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. Man. You ready? I don't know why all these people showed up. I'm gonna catch one. Oh. <laughs> that one? Yeah. Nice, dude. It's a nice fish. Very cool. Solid bass, man, on the Ica. So what do we do now? I'm gonna try and net this bad boy. With the Promar net? Yes, sir. Does it work? Oh, it's a net! <laughs> that a boy, dude. We just started off 2021. Dude. Oh, oh your camera! Look at this fish! Look at solid bass! Dude, the Ica, it's a pretty cool bait. You throw it out there, you let it sink, pop it a couple times on the bottom, and repeat. Patience is the name of the game with this bait because it's it sinks really, really slow. How deep was that thing? Probably about 20 foot of water. Our rules out here... In our little club shootout. In our little club shootout are, you take a weight of this guy real quick, which is right here. And get a good weight on her. 215. Very cool. Good first good fish, really. First fish, and the best part about it is you get them right back in the water. Not that big. It's about the same as that last one. I'm going to flip them. Okay. No BS, that was on the bottom. I popped it a couple times and he just smoked it. But, I mean, that was what? Five minutes after the last one? If you're throwing a Senko and an Ica, it is literally the same technique. Patience is the game. Throw it out there. Give it time to sink. If you're in 30 foot of water, give it at least. Hey, hey, hey. are you bit? <laughs> it's snagged. No, I'm snagged. <laughs> the, the magic in the bait is that free falling motion. Go side to side. It looks delicious to these little guys. Two, one. That, that's, that's the coolest part about it, man. And it produces fish like no other. So get yourself some Sankos, get yourself some Icas, free falling baits. It's, it's, it's killer on the suspending fish and killer on the fish on the bottom. Just let it do its job. Got him. Oh, he came off, he broke off. Filler, what the hell, dude? They're biting, they're hitting, I ain't shit. Come on, man, you can't be doing that in a <gasps> tournament. Gotta get him out. He's coming through? Nice and easy, it's only eight. It's a good one, I think. I don't think we have a good chance of landing this fish though. Light line. He's like in some stuff. Easy come out? A little bit. Nice and slow, nice and slow. You want him to move around in that brush. Kinda, it'll, it'll get that. God. That's rough, dude. Hey, they're biting. I know. I hate losing them. Damn it. Well, you screwed it up. <laughs> Big him? Mm -hmm. Trying to get him up. That's right next to you. On again. What'd you do different this time? I uh, retied. 
going on? I put 10 pound test on instead so I can get them up out of these, uh, there's giant brush down here, you know? Big bushes and trees. Yeah, so when you get bit, you're in those trees immediately. So this bite, I got them up high as quickly as I could. You got one? Good? No. Net. Just gonna play her out. Get my little pro net here. Oh, Josh! What are you doing? It's smaller than yours, brother. It's a fish, man. That's number three. So, drop shot basically, you got your sinker on the bottom, your warm up top, and since Philip's been kind of catching him on the sink, I'm barely moving it. And he was just there. Good job. 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 Good he is wrapped around this thing. Just play with him. Got him. We can flip him. That's five, baby! Finally got our five. I switched over. Pat keeps getting bit on the drop shot. Problem is, the line is too light and he's breaking off, so I switched up to 12 pound. Bigger drop shot sinker to kind of get down there, get through those trees quicker, and a, a thicker wire EWG hook, worm hook. So, okay. that helped out, helped me get this. I need to retie that, look at that. Can you get that? Afraid, afraid of what you say? Those bushes. All right guys, we are done. We are out of the water. What worked for us was the Ica, weedless and weightless. Drop shot, weedless, that's about it. Uh, we had some heartbreaks early in the morning, heartbreak in the afternoon. Other than that, man, this is a really, really good bite for January to be down here fishing. So if you guys can make it down to San Vicente, while this weather's still good, I think next week it's supposed to cool down or rain, get down here, man. You're not going to get January fishing like this. It's, it's really good. Really good. Uh, thanks for watching. As always, subscribe, share, like, do what you got to do on your end to keep us going. And uh, we'll keep the content flowing. Thanks for watching.